On the 11th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me birch tree candle holders. Yeah, yeah, you see? You keep singing and people do stupid things. Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make tea light holders out of wood. So uh, the wood I've chosen to use today is just, it's actually a fire, a fire log I bought. You could use birch or whatever wood you like. So this is what I chose to use. I'm going to cut three different um, heights, so it's going to be kind of a pillar effect, a staggered height. So safety first. Here we go. Look how easy that was. Holy. So the next step now is we're going to get our drill and this is a one and a half inch spade bit. And I chose this one because it is exactly the diameter of the tea light. So I'm going to get uh, some help here. Why it's Dave. <laughs> Okay, so we've drilled the hole now. I'm just gonna see if the tea light fits. Great, perfect. So while we're at it, I wanna show you another version. Um, this will be a tabletop version using this beautiful piece of birch. So we're gonna flatten the bottom of it and then drill three holes for tea lights because we're all about options here at Art Resin. <laughs> if I don't survive, it was nice to know you <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ooh, That is beautiful. Let's go drill some holes. We're gonna resin it and it's gonna look amazing. So I've already uh, mixed my resin and my hardener together here and now I'm ready to art resin my tea light holders. Okay, so instead of brushing it on, what I'm actually gonna do is just use my hands. Gloved hands, of course. And then the reason for that, it's got a lot of little crevices and nooks, especially this one. So if I use my hands, then I can just make sure that it's covered. So I'll just get a bit of resin on my hands. So I just like the option of being able to use these indoors or outdoors because the art resin is going to make them weatherproof. Okay, so we're going to let these sit for 24 hours and uh, we'll see how they look tomorrow. Okay, great. So we've got our um, tree tea light holders and I couldn't be more pleased with how they turned out. It's amazing. And again, the reason we resin them is to make them suitable for outdoor use. This is going to preserve them, it's going to stop the wood from rotting, and you know what, it adds kind of a holiday sparkle too to it as well. Okay, so I'm just going to light these up and see how they look. I think that looks really, really pretty. Happy holidays!